not only is it a homeless in America, there's homeless in Canada. There's so many homeless people in America. There's over 50,000 homeless people in every state of America. And these are homeless people in Canada. Look at all the homeless sleeping. This is Sunday morning now. This is Lord's country. Lord's world. What happened for the blessings of America and our four founding fathers? In the red, white, and blue. And all the stars, the girls so beautiful. Like stars in our flag. And you got all these homeless and hungry and jobless people. What happened to America when there's over 50,000 homeless people in every state? And a lot of people suffer from mental disorders, unsound minds, or they wouldn't be in the streets. And they don't get disability checks. They don't get housing. They don't get food stamps. They don't get Section 8. They don't get WIC. Some of them have kids. Now imagine how far that sky is away. And they say, God's love is beyond that. Now you imagine how much the Lord loves you. And you ever love an animal or your wife or your kids? You know how much you love them so much and you know that you love them. God loves you more than that. There's an outcry. All these homeless people, jobless, hungry. What are we going to do, America? Because there's a hunger rise and the jobs are unlimited in other countries. But there's a system here. And you got abandoned warehouses everywhere. Hobo Jesus said God growed the seed and sowed it. There could be jobs in these abandoned warehouses. We could be making butter sticks and having edibles for medical purposes in every state in America. We need to get our House of Representatives and our state legislators to veto these bills because it's a crying shame. There are not enough resources. Can you imagine how cold it is in the winter? When it's so cold that dogs are stuck to fire hydrants. People out here sleeping in that cold, cold, colder winter day than a mother-in-law's kiss. God loves you. Amen, amen, amen.